Hi, my name is Billy Nobel, and I am a touring and session keyboard player based here in Nashville, Tennessee. I have recently come in contact with a company called Virgin Musical Instruments. They are doing some really cool things by making great keyboard instruments that are accessible to many people because of their price points. I've had for a year or two now the X-Key, which is one of their um, small MIDI controllers. And now I am um, going to talk to you about the Artesia DP3 Plus Home Digital Piano, which is a very nice looking piano. It's a digital piano, it's a keyboard here, and it is housed in a uh, cabinet with a rosewood finish. Just looking at the outside of the instrument here, um, a few things to note. It's got a nice hammer action balanced key bed. Um, and this key bed is trying to mimic the feel of an upright piano or of a piano in general. You are heavier notes on the bottom and your lighter notes on the top. So these will feel a lot lighter. These will feel a lot heavier. We have the three pedals down here um, that come standard on most pianos. Um, the sustain pedal, the sostenuto pedal, and the unicorda pedal. And then you are getting your sound from a couple of speakers right here, and then there's a couple speakers underneath on either side of the piano. There's a MIDI out port so that you can send your MIDI information um, to say a session or um, a recording. Um, there's a USB out to host. There's an aux in jack and an input level knob, which I have not used yet, but I'm excited about that because it sounds like you can take your iPhone and the music on your iPhone and uh, put it into the aux in here, turn up the input level of the aux in, and then practice along to some of your favorite music. These are the first things I see on the exterior of the piano. Um, and we're gonna go into some more detail on what the piano can do. So I would like to go from left to right here uh, on the front panel and sort of explain what everything does. Um, starting here with your power button and then you have your volume knob, very straightforward. You have your demo button so you can hear what the piano can do. Your metronome. Now this is important for practicing. Um, I used to practice when I was a kid. I still do with the metronome, which you can set. So right now it's set at 120, and then you can bring it down here. Let's say I put it on 108 and I do some scales. Just as a musician, I cannot stress enough the importance of practicing to a metronome. And that's great that this piano features that. Um, your layer button right here. So currently I have a piano sample pulled up. If I hit the layer button, it defaults to piano and strings underneath. So that's nice, it adds a little bit of depth. And um, you can take the layer button and choose what, when you press layer, you can choose which instrument here that you would like underneath the piano. So right now I have an, right now I have an organ underneath the piano sound. The split button will put an instrument in the bass section of the piano while keeping your primary instrument, which I've selected as piano, um, up front in the right hand. Your reverb button does just what you would think it would do. It adds reverb to your sound. So without the reverb button, the piano is 
dry and releases pretty quickly. If I add the reverb button, it creates a nice echo. Now, the first few seconds that you press the reverb button, you can adjust the kind of reverb, the amount of reverb, by hitting these plus or minus buttons here. So I'm going to go to number 8. It has a nice ring to it. Same with the chorus effect. You can add chorus to your instrument, which would be a really nice thing to do, say, on the E piano here. Um, right now it's just a standard Wurlitzer Rhodes type sound. And then if I add chorus, you get that. Broadening of the sound. Um, and like the reverb, you can change the type and amount of chorus that you would like um, on your sound. Now, talking over the different voices you can use, and by voices, um, they mean instruments. Um, voice is a common term for that. Starting with the piano sound, the piano is a three layer suprasound um, sample, and the piano gives you the full depth and expression of an acoustic piano. So this is great for those wanting to learn piano, practice piano at home, that might not want the um, maintenance and the cost of a uh, upright piano. They can get this Artesia DP3 digital piano and have a very nice piano sample to practice and learn with. Um, some playing around on it earlier and it's a very nice sound. Um, we can do an electric piano which I mentioned earlier. We can do a harpsichord. If you're feeling some Baroque vibes. Um, speaking of vibes, the next voice is vibes, vibraphone. Then we have a, looks like a nylon guitar. Some strings and some bass. And all of these voices can be layered in with each other. Um, and by that, as I mentioned earlier, I mean that you can take a harpsichord, for example, and then let's press the layer button and it looks like the preset is the organ layered with the harpsichord. Or it could be set on organ because I did that earlier. So, uh, so you can sort of make your own sound and uh, mess around with a combination of a couple sounds, which is pretty cool. Um, the duet button. Okay, so we're now leaving the voice select panel and we're going to the duet button. This is cool for playing piano duets with your friends or if a teacher wants to show you something and you want to play as well. This splits the keyboard in half so that the ranges are the same on each uh, part of the keyboard. So let me go to piano sample here. We're in duet mode. I'm on a piano. So clearly this note matches this note and on down the line. It's pretty fun actually. Um, so the duet is very handy when another person is involved with your playing or with your teaching. And so if you're wanting to learn the piano, practice the piano, play the piano, create a couple layers of sounds, do a small bit of recording, just get creative and indulge in music, then Artesia is making instruments that are affordable and accessible for people to put in their homes and enjoy uh, what music is and what music is all about. <laughs>